I just recall how clear the sky was. It was one of those September days, like a blue that you could see all the way to the stars. It's especially painful when you have a beautiful, clear flying day to not be on the schedule. Where we wanted to be was in the air, not in a meeting. As we're in this scheduling meeting, an airplane just crashed into the World Trade Center. We're like, how the heck does that happen? It didn't occur to us that it'd be anything other than a small airplane, maybe giving a tourist flight on the Hudson. It wasn't until another aircraft hit the Trade Center and it's on purpose. That's when I remember seeing, seeing those images. It came from the television that we first realized that I think the Pentagon was hit. This is our area of responsibility, and if there's anybody who could do anything at the time, it would have been us. But part of the challenge was when we're doing training missions, we don't have light weapons loaded up. That was the scenario we ended in, yeah. is how long is this going to take? They said it's going to take an hour. We have some planes, just stay quiet and you'll be okay. When we realized that it was going to take too long, we said, we got to go. So. That's when Lucky and I, we threw in our gear, and by then they had two airplanes that were ready for us. What mattered to us at the time was that our nation was under attack. We need to defend our nation's capital, and that's what we had sworn an oath to do. So it wasn't until you said, I'll take out the cockpit, that you know it was very clear that if we were successful, we would not be coming back. <laughs> 